look at the vital study. This was a the um, a trial conducted at Harvard University with over 25,000 participants, including even 5,000 African-Americans. Half received 2,000 IU per day vitamin D3 and half placebo for a median of 5.3 years. The mean baseline 25 reduction vitamin D for those providing values in the vitamin D treatment arm was 31 nanograms per milliliter. All participants were proceeded to take up to 600, 800 IU per day as well, spend time in the time uh, time in the sun and eat whatever they liked. It was published in New England Journal of Medicine in 2019. For the entire group, there was a significant 25% reduction in all cancer mortality rate, but no significant effect on cancer incidence. However, for those with BMI at less than 25 kilograms per meter square, there was non-obese. There was a significant 25% reduction in cancer incidence for African Americans who had significant lower 25 for vitamin D concentration at baseline, there was a barely non-significant 25 reduction in cancer incidence. The abstract, which is what most physicians read, did not mention these beneficial results, nor did Joanna Manson in all the news conferences, all the public published report, reporting, did not mention them. As I mentioned, this is published in New England Journal and advertised in Big Pharma. It limits abstracts to one outcome per study. So it's not gonna, not gonna promote vitamin D. No sorry, Bob.